Well, 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 greetings and hello there, everybody. It's 25 weeks today of farming Lord Vader free to play in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes as you wanted me to do. And the punishing one is out. Everybody's asking me, hey, is the punishing one really destroying the idea of your negotiator with Marauder Fleet working while you farm your way toward Lord Vader? Is it destroying the idea of negotiator and Marauder being a viable early game team we're going to take a close look at that we're also going to jump in here and i'm going to be doing the duel of the fates assault battle on tier three i've got my characters ready at seven stars we want to see if i can i can earn all these nice little mod rewards that you can get through tier three here which would be a big ad for this roster for sure that's the main two topics of the day but let's keep in mind along the way here that we're at week 25 right now that means that next week is our one half year a half a year of farming Lord Vader free to play in Star Wars Galaxy Heroes, kind of meandering our way around some assault battle teams. In the meantime, do doing some different things, trying out some new and different stuff on this roster. Let's jump into our first conversation. We're going to go over to the Fleet Arena right now. Uh, right there, Fleet Arena. Yes, so of course, for this account, I'm farming Lord Vader. I've got to get Padme. All this Galactic Republic stuff going on with the account. And we took a different path. Instead of farming Executor early, which I, I believe is the right path. And even more reinforced now. But we, we went Negotiator. We went, we went the Negotiator path. And uh, thanks to our, foul, our pal Sanjita, who kind of showed that this is a viable early path to farm this Negotiator here with your, with your roster. And I had it up and running with Endurance before I activated Negotiator. I had Anakin, Houndstooth, etc., in there it was running really well for me with endurance it's been running even better with negotiator i stay there are days where i have stayed number three the entire day and i've got my marauder it's really in good shape right now i've got i've got uh i always want to say order 99 plan 99 here on it which is really important it basically gives it a second life uh, that's maxed out i've got maxed out here on hunter's ability i've got tech's ability not quite maxed out but we're getting there uh, and, and I'm kind of going to, we'll talk about that in a second, but I'm kind of getting away from this. I, I think it's good enough where it is right now for to work for me for a while in Fleet Arena. But with that said, there is a uh, an executor above me. And when we look at people below, there are people here. You, you know that these are executor fleets, right? These are going to be bounty hunter fleets. Wow, 81 with a five-star negotiator. Interesting. Um, so, yeah, so there are executors. Come Another one. These negotiators, why are you guys down here? What's up with that? If you got Negotiator, you should have been far... Oh, man, I, you just didn't prepare yourself. I, that's all I can say about that. Anywho, there are Executors coming, and does Punishing One really make this a problem that I've farmed this fleet? I'm going to say it, and I'll just be honest. This is a temporary account for me. It's probably going to last about another year while we get our way to Lord Vader and we do all the assault battles. So for me, I'm going to be fine. I'm going to be okay. I do think it puts a major crimp in the idea that you can farm early uh, the Endurance with Galactic Republic and get Marauder out there, you know, because Marauder was beating Executors along the way. And now with the Punishing one, we're showing that's a little more iffy, <laughs> a lot more iffy. I feel like someone's going to find a counter here at some point, but yeah, so I, I feel like I don't want to say this is out the window because I'm obviously performing pretty well with it. But now in new fleet arena shards that pop up, the you know, going forward, and people are going to go straight for Executor in those, I'm not sure this is going to be super viable. Um, you know, if you've got 10 people at the top of your fleet arena with Executor and Punishing One, and you're dropping a Negotiator in there with Marauder, and you can't beat that Executor, yeah, you got some problems on your hands. You're not going to be getting in top 10, although you might be able to finish in top 10 for quite some time because i do believe that if you get in the right guild you can get negotiator faster than executor one more point on this i'll say is that uh on my pay to play account my my new two lightspeed account it was at the six month mark where i unlocked executor and that was with lighter spending i wasn't spending major amounts of money at the time i was spending somewhere between 50 to 100 bucks a month just to keep my crystal income going and i popped a few extra uh, a little extra money there at the end just to get the ships up and get everything ready to go. So you can get Executor in six months. I fully start ex expect to start seeing them in my fleet arena shard here very soon. And once that happens, we will further and more understand the impact of that. And maybe see if we can find a counter. I will tell you that my Marauder where it is right now at six stars with these, with these, uh, with my undergeared Bad Batch has not been able to even like, it doesn't even get a turn. It gets wiped out against the Punishing One before it even goes. And they... They literally go through 
go through it once, and then Plan 99 keeps it there, and they go through it again, and they just wipe out the Marauder, and I'm sitting there with Marauderless trying to beat an ex- a full executor fleet. It just doesn't work for me. So that's part one. Part two here um, is what, what, and by the way, let's look at that those bad bats that we're, we're working on. Um, and, and talk about what's coming up next. I got record gear 12. We're going to leave him there for a while. That's just another 100 Kyro to get into Relic, and I, I can wait a while in that. Hunter's at gear 11. Tech is at gear 10. I'm going to hold off. I need 200 Kyro here to get into gear 11. I don't feel like that's a good trade-off for me at the moment, so I'm going to shift my focus away from the Bad Batch now. I have been focused on them, leaving Wrecker up here in the farming spot. Because when I farm him, I also get my Galactic Republic Y-Wing. I need to get that thing up and running. That's going to be another couple of months to get that done. Uh, maybe three months. I don't know. It's going to take a while. So, and here's where every, everybody I'm farming right here. Jango Fit is not being farmed. That is my Houndstooth farm. I'm doubling up on Houndstooth and Marauder every day to get them to seven stars. So I am doing that. But I don't want to spend any more Kyrotex on my Bad Batch at the moment. So I'm going to shift my attention over to the, the fellas that we're about to use today. Padawan, Obi-Wan, and Master Qui-Gon are going to get focused on. I'm going to get these guys Relic. I'm going to get them to Relic 7 so I can start getting even more materials in this monthly assault battle. That'll be the first assault battle. Now, actually, we've already done stuff with our Inversio Troopers, but that'll be another assault battle to add to our arsenal and a very good assault battle at that. Do I, I don't think I have the graphic here in this. I don't have it. So, but yeah, it's it's a great assault battle as far as materials. But before I do those guys, I'm going to relic my Wampa. I am very close. I got 15 Omicrons here. I think I'm within a week or a week and a half of getting, I'm, I'm, you know, you get these every now and then in Cantina battles. I'm going to have my Omicrons here for Wampa pretty soon. So I'm going to take her to relic uh, as soon as I can. So I'm farming these right now. These The squid Kyrotex, I've, I've called them along the way. And I'm farming these uh, Armatech HoloLenses. So I'm going to do Wampa to Relic just for Grand Arena purposes. The better you do in Grand Arena, the more crystals you get every day at the end of every Grand Arena round. So that's what's going on with the account right now and what we're focused on as far as our ships. Double sharding for Houndstooth, double sharding Marauder, hanging out in the top five of, of, squad, of Fleet Arena every day. And, uh, and yeah, so I'm perfectly happy with that. Almost half a year. Next week is half a year. Let's go play. Excuse me there. The Duel of the Fates Assault Battle here. I'm going to show you my characters. Here is Padawan Obi-Wan. He is gear 9. And with his mod set here and offense set, I've got speed. i got crit damage and speed. Um, I've got offense down here. Not a lot of speed. I mean, there's not a lot of speed on this guy. There's health down there. There's de- there. I've got an offense set. Not a lot of speed on old Padawan Obi-Wan there. And mismatching, you know, uh, mismatch. Do I have a potency arrow that I can put? I don't think I do. Is that speed? Oh, let's do that. Does he land any debuffs? This one has more offense anyway, so let's go ahead and put it on there. I don't know that he landed any, lands any debuffs. Let's look at his kit here real quick. Is damn it. Uh, inflict defense down. Okay, so there you go. We'll inflict defense down a little better with a little bit, a little bit more potency. I have not invested in the Zetas yet, so there are no Zetas on these two characters. I'm trying to show you guys. Hopefully, we can get this done at gear 9 with just mediocre mods. And uh, that's Qui-Gon. That's regular Qui-Gon. Master Qui-Gon, that's what I want. I don't know if you can do it with regular Qui-Gon either, but uh, Master Qui-Gon here, we got a speed set on him. It's not a great speed set. Uh, there's uh, 9 speed, 9 speed, 16 speed, 10. I mean, that's, that, that 16's kind of a nice little mod, isn't it? Um, so I've got him sitting there at uh, 231 total speed. I do not have his Zeta either. So let's go do this uh, this round of uh, Duel of the Fates Assault Battle to see if we can get this done against Maul with with my mods and everything the way it is right now. I think I want to... Yeah, let's dispel those buffs. I have, I have advantage right now. Let's go ahead and hit him. There we go. Now, somebody told me to just to do basics here. Is that right? Because I think it's, I think it's Obi-Wan's basic. There's a breach. The potency down. I don't know if that's really okay. That ability for Qui Gon's actually the most important. Is that uh, that buff blocker there? I'm gonna okay. Qui Gon's about dead. He ain't doing so well. Maybe I should have had more health and protection on him. I don't know. Crit damage up. Yeah. 
Qui-Gon makes the coolest sound. Ooh, Qui-Gon's out. It's like defense down. It's like potency down. I'm gonna have to try this again. Let's try it again. Somebody told me they did it easily. That didn't look easily to me. Let's think about this here real quick. So, Master Qui-Gon, his basic, special damage and breach. All Galactic Republic allies will heal over time. Okay, if he has accuracy up. Maybe I need a little more health and protection on him. Dispel all buffs. If they had any buffs, dispel buff immunity, which we got. Um, defense for two turns. Deal special damage. Let's take a look at something here. Are these both speed? Yeah. Let's get speed mods, and let's get some either health or protection as the primary stat. Let's find those. Well, um, I'm going to go ahead and trade that out. And that's only 4 speed. What do we got here? 10 speed. We're going to drop this. That's already defense, though. And he gained some defense, but let's go ahead and... His health was the problem. Health was the problem. That was what was dropping down low. Let's try that out. I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be better or not. Okay, let's go. Let's dispel our debuffs here. Instead, last time I did the other one. Okay, that's that was a better result there. I'm gonna wait. What, what am I doing with that second ability on Obi Wan? Physical damage dazed them. Okay, I like that. Let's dispel that buff. Get ability block. Thank you. Or not ability block. Buff block. Let's get our offense up. So I guess that's what you do. Oh, I didn't gain defense up and offense up. If there's an ally master Qui-Gon, the target has less, less than 50% health. That's when he gains defense and penetration. Okay. 50% or more, he gains 20% turn meter and foresight. Yeah, okay. The foresight and the turn meter, we need to keep pumping here, I think. I just don't feel like we're doing enough damage on the guy. Alright. Looks like it's going to be about the same result here. Hold on. Well, Qui-Gon's hanging in there. Deal with this one. Okay, we needed that. Hanging in there. Still hanging in there. Should have maybe done my meditation that time. No longer hanging in there. I can't gain Terminator right now. Actually, that's not what I was going to do. I don't know, man. Somebody said they got this done easily, and I don't see this being easily unless I put some really nice mods on these guys. Let's try it again. And no, I don't think regular Quiet gonna be would be better here. I keep doing the wrong one there. Uh, okay, let's swing this around. The foresight is what really matters there. I mean, I know they get the turn meter game, but... Wish I could pop some foresight on old Qui-Gon over there. I'll do this. Yeah, not having foresight, I get landed with the days is what happens. Mm -hmm. 
I gotta keep that foresight on, basically. Let's do this. Okay. I mean, I'm getting offense up anyway. Okay, here we go. Yeah. There you go, fellas. You go, fellas. Come on. Come on, boys. No? Come on, boys. Let's get this done. Come on! Let's go! Hey, come on! <laughs> there we go! Oh my goodness! <laughs> that was no easy task, but look at those sweet mod materials we got, and now we will be cruising this on auto the rest of the way every time, or simming it, whatever, you know what I mean. Sim, auto, you get the idea. We will take it. I will take those results very much today. And there you go. Stay tuned for some uh, Grand Arena action after the credits. We've got it coming up. I hope everybody has a great day. I'll talk to you soon. And always, of course, remember... Where is it? Nooch too good. Right, folks here we are with round one of grand arena another round one and take a look at my opponent big fat ray over there 5.75 million kylo has been farmed um ships we got a full negotiator we got a gas bundle i think actually uh look at that relic 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 well all the bundles hang on yep we got a gas bundle purchased we've got uh what do we got down here i think we have the shadows the empire bundle Nice. So just a bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm up against it right now. Let's see what's happened. Did he play? Did Maz play? Maz has not played. So I think I'll go in. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I bet I could beat this. I know I can beat that. I know I can beat that. I bet there's no mods in these things either. Let's take a look at. Uh, I, bet I could beat that too, maybe. Yeah, well there are mods. Some mods, not good mods, but some mods. All right, um, here's what we're gonna do. Five million, and this is the defense, and all right, so uh, let's see, do I have to kill this with my, I, I feel like I can bad batch this. I don't know, dude, I don't I might be overestimating what my bad batch are capable of, but I wanna try it. I mean, worst case, I come in back in, I mean, my bad batch, Yeah, let's just try it. Let me think here. Well, here's the thing. If he plays, he wins. He's just going to win. I don't think he's going to play. Let's try it out. Let's try it. My Bad Batch might be better suited for the up top. It's kind of what I was thinking there. But I'm going to give this a shot. If I can get all the stuns, maybe. If I get all the stuns? I got three of them. That's not great. Okay, that's some good damage. I'm not going to get stuns here. We'll do this. Okay. All right. Era's out. I'd like to stun Zeb because he's kind of annoying. Thank you. And that's nothing personal, Zeb. I just think you're annoying. I just love doing my basic here. That expose, it just ends up doing a lot of damage. Now we can stun him all again. Thank you. All but Zeb again. Sabine's out. Get these landed again. We got this. It's over. Alright. Can we go for a full clear on a guy that's got a roster five times our size? 
Maybe I'm thinking a little bit too positive, right? I'm gonna go ahead and auto this. Good job, Bad Batch. Good job, well done. Once again proving Phoenix without Captain Rex, completely useless. Much like the Chicago Cubs. <laughs> Sorry to my Chicago audience members. I wish I had Wampa up and running right now. That's This is actually kind of a difficult team. And I don't have the juice to get through it. So I'm going to do... Yeah, I wish I had Wampa up and running right now. So... Because my Wampa would beat that. But there's no Omicron yet. So I'm not going to be able to do it. Here's what we'll do. We'll, we'll beat this top team just to give ourselves a shot at uh, at a fleet win. But I, I don't have a team that's going to compete with... I, I can only beat one of these teams, right? I split these guys up now. Yeah. Maybe if I'd saved Captain Rex, I would have a shot at that back team. But even then, probably not. So we'll beat this team, and then we'll go see if we can beat that fleet. All right, this should be relatively easy. In fact, I bet I could auto this. Let's just auto it. Do I have to say it again that mods matter? I'm not sure this, I could probably beat this team even with mods. Now, if they had like Zetas and Omicrons, maybe not, but he's not gonna add Zetas and Omicrons. He's just farming stuff from uh, Lightspeed bundles. What's in the back? What's the fleet? Home one, we'll be able to beat this, I think. That's not a... What a weird fleet. That's a weird fleet. In fact, without without the finalizer there, you shouldn't have Kylo's shuttle on the front line. I don't need all this, but I'm not worried about banners. Like I said, if he plays, he wins. If I had my Wampa Omicron on, which is still a couple weeks away, I'd be able to beat that... Um, uh, what should I do? Let's do this. We'll get rid of the shuttle. It can be annoying over time. Yeah, if I had my Wampa Omicron on, then I would I would be able to beat that Phasma team, no problem. By the way, I got uh, I got Order 99 or whatever. It's not Order 99, but Plan 99. I got that ready now. So next round of Grand Arena, we'll have that on our uh, on our uh, Marauder. A little overkill here. That's fine. It's gonna auto this too. Let's just get this done with. If he if he plays and he throws, he can he can get out there. He can beat my banners easily. Not to mention he can clear my whole map easily. Come on, man taking too long. I got things to do. I got people to see. Alright, that's done. This is way... I should not be able to get this much work done against a roster that's much bigger than mine. I really shouldn't. It, this should not be happening. And it's about to stop happening. Let's try this. Let's put Wampa in there, but we'll have a taunt. Get Hans... Uh, let's put these two guys in. Not that. Let's put these two guys in. Take a shot here. I don't think this works, but let's take a shot. I should I've, I I should be targeting him. That's a mistake by me. Now nah, Wampa's not countering anybody. Wampa's dead. Yeah, we. It had to be Wampa with an Omicron, and that would have worked, but. It wouldn't have mattered. It wouldn't have mattered if I targeted Tie Pilot first. Yeah. I hope you're proud of the technological terror you've constructed. All right, there we go. That's round one. I don't know. I'm sure you'll see in about ten seconds whether I won or not. Well, all right, everybody. We're here in round three, and things are getting ugly. Uh, you, for those of you complaining that I'm not facing anybody with Galactic Legends, and I'm facing doable rosters for me, which I'm not exactly sure is the case when I really look at it. I, I, I again, I've faced three rosters at my galactic power or lower out of uh, 39 matches now. So 
is that even that's not even one percent is it no i'm sorry 39 yes that 10 percent that's uh it's below it's like seven or eight <laughs> percent i got a little aggressive there but anyway this is the first round i faced and the guy had two galactic legends and i lost to him i know kylo wasn't fully done but he was still a galactic legend second round i just forgot to play i just you get busy life happens life comes along there's no galactic legends here i actually might have had an opportunity to beat this guy because he got stuck on my qui-gon and i feel like there's teams in here i could have beaten but you know what i'm streaming grand arena with you guys and i got something to do on the side and i go busy with that and then all of a sudden it's six o'clock and i go ah, i didn't play grand arena so i don't know if i could have gotten through that team or not i think i maybe but uh, anyway so we're on round three, and congratulations to you guys for wishing doom upon me. Because we got Jabba and Jedi Master Luke and 7.3 million galactic power. <laughs> what are you doing a Carbonite 2 or 3? What are you doing a Carbonite 3, my friend? Um, and uh, yeah, he played. Thumbs up. A big thumbs up. All right, so let's play this round here. I'm going to try... I have yet to try my... Now, uh, by the way, once I'm not beating that CLS team up top. I think it's probably Relic. So, we haven't yet tried this here. Somebody told me with the Omicron it works really well. So, let's see what happens. I'm going to pull this. I kind of feel like I'm not going to get anything done here. But we'll see. I've definitely never done this counter before. This will be the first time. Ah, it's going okay. Turn meter reduction. That's a good thing. Now we smack them all. All right, well, that did work. Yeah, clean. clean o pino. Okay, there we go. That was easy. All right, Iden takes care of Now, there are a couple of gear 12 in there. Um, what's he gotten back? Uh, he's probably, like, did something sneaky here. Oh, Wampa kills that. Let's kill that with Wampa. Oh, I don't have Omicron yet. I don't know if a gear 12 Wampa would kill it regardless. Uh, I have zero... Uh, uh, my chances of beating this team are like negative 5,000%. It's under 9,000. It's under negative 9,000. Yeah, that joke didn't work. I thought I could do a... a uh, yeah, you guys get it. Anyway. Uh, I think we'll take a shot here. And I don't know if this, this... I think there's a chance this works. Not a good chance, but there's a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. I need, I need five stuns. Uh, I got a few. Forgot about the dodge. Only at nine stacks here. I should have held that. I should have held that AoE. That was actually a pretty solid mistake. Come on, Rex. Hit him. Okay. Ah, oh, come on. Did I have to take Grievous below 100% health? Really? I'm going to do this just to remove stacks. That was actually pretty effective. Here we go. Remove all those buffs. Go back to Tech, who's not going to have that ability loaded. Oh, there you do have that ability. I thought we didn't have that. Okay, I think we're gonna beat this team. It looks pretty good so far. This would be a big stun. Noise. Yeah, that's it. Game over. And then my game is over. Congrats to me for killing two teams. Uh, I have nothing for the 7 million Galactic Power roster with two Galactic Legends. And I'm not even going to try. I'm not even going to try against CLS. I shan't put out my i don't even know what i would put out that might even like afford me anything hey that's it i'm out so that's an 0 and three i think i was three and oh last time wasn't i crazy the 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 diversity of rosters here at the below at the grand arena lower levels is absolutely insane so that's an 0 and three uh let's let's go ahead i'm gonna update the spreadsheet let me bring up the spreadsheet so you guys can see it hey, boom okay so Zooming in, this will be uh, 23 and 16. Was I? Oh, what, I was last time around 21, 20. Yeah, last time I was 3 and 0. So this time I am 0 and 3. Crazy how that works. We gotta fill this in here. I think I do that color. Yep. And did not play. Loss. What's that score? 
440 to 877. Uh, yeah, so notice these matchups here. 5.7 million, 7.3 million. Previous round was 3. Point, I, I beat a guy 3.8 million, but I beat a guy 4.8 million. He didn't play. I've beaten 7. I lost to 7 million. Anyway, you guys, I mean, I'm facing giant rosters. Whether they have Galactic Legends or not, these rosters are all bigger than mine. I'm just able to beat most of these players on this. I can just, I just outskill them and I outfarm them. And, but there we go. Um, Rand Arena. Pretty rough round, boys and girls. We will come back to you next week with uh, the final rounds of 5v5 Grand Arena. I will talk to you soon. Always remember, it's too good.